All right. Thanks for coming back. Let's uh, keep going here with Moses and the wanderings. The wanderings talks about uh, the people of Israel. So let's take a look at that. First of all, let's take a look at the timeline that we've covered up until this point. Remember, we talked about creation, the Big Bang, Adam and Eve, the fall, uh, Eve, the apple, all that, the getting kicked out of the Garden of Eden. We talked about Abraham and Sarah having a baby, uh, even though they were very, very old. We talked about uh, Jacob and Esau and uh, the rivalry that they had and Jacob's name being changed to Israel. And then eventually through uh, Jacob and Jacob's sons and hundreds of years later, uh, one, we're going to talk about Moses. Moses comes on the scene a little bit later. So uh, that is how we kind of looked in our pictures here from the very beginning. And we're getting up. You can see our rough prehistory into uh, years, you know, roughly about 700 years between where we were last time. So we're going to keep diving into that. So let's talk about Jacob. That was the last person we talked about, Jacob and Esau and wrestling with God and all that kind of stuff. Jacob wrestled with God. <clears throat> now he's known as Israel. Jacob then had 12 sons. Genesis tells us there the names are right there. Reuben, Simeon, Levi, Judah, Dan, Naphtali, Gad, Asher, Issachar, Zebulun, Joseph, and Benjamin. And if you've ever seen Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat, uh, you're going to learn all about this kind of stuff. It's a great musical, uh, if you haven't seen it, by the way. Uh, Jacob's favorite son was Joseph, and Joseph was given a coat. His brothers got very, very jealous, and they sold Joseph into slavery. And Joseph... Uh, even though he went through a lot of hard times, he trusted God's plan. And at the very end, he didn't end up only saving his family, but he ended up saving Egypt as well. And we're going to talk a little bit about that story. So anywhere from 64 to a couple hundred years pass, and then Moses comes on the scene. Okay, so that's what we're going to talk about today. But first of all, we're going to learn a little bit about uh, Joseph. So I want you to go take a look at this Joseph clip. And it will tell us uh, everything we need to know to get you up to speed on Joseph. And I'll see you here in... when you're done. All right. Good luck. <laughs> 